Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to my last demonstration video with Silent Hunter 4, Wolves of the Pacific. This one, I will be tracking and destroying, hopefully, a target using nothing but sonar. Well, sonar and the map and all the tools on the map. You get the gist of it. So, we are well below periscope depth. Just... Oh, we just got a contact on sonar, so I will order my sonar operator to track him. Double check everything on the map. It looks like we're already stopped, which is perfect. So, he is probably out of range, but just to confirm, we'll go to the sonar station, bump the bearing up to 86 degrees, and send out a ping. Once again, I did design this myself, so it's a little simplistic. No ping back, so he's out of range. It's a little simplistic, but I did it to teach myself how to do this, and I think I learned pretty well. And despite being simplistic, I'm going to be doing all the work right here, so it's not like I'm going to have an advantage because I already know what everything does, even though I do. I'm going to plug in a couple things just to make my work a little easier in the future. The compass is being used to help me find range once it shows up. The protractor is being used to help me find bearing once... Well, that's already up. As we just discovered, he's at 86 degrees. So, he is somewhere along this line. What we need to do right now is wait until we can get a good reading on him. Bring up my watch, just to make everything easier. And then we'll wait. I'll wait until 7.10, I'll say. Time compression makes things a lot better. That being said, it's still kind of slow, isn't it? Bump this up to 85, see what we can get. Looks like he's still out of range. So we are going to wait a little bit longer. Sonar operator thinks he's still about 85 degrees bearing, er, on 85 degrees bearing. We'll check 84 as well, but... If you'll excuse me, I need to yell at my cat for a moment. Sorry about that. The little bastard listened to me this time. We'll go ahead and wait 15 minutes or so since he's going very slowly. Eight, four, 84 degrees only now. That's pretty slow. Go ahead and hop in our sonar station. Bump that up to 84. He's not even in range of multiple loops of this. So, once again, we wait. Since he is going so slow, we'll just skip it right past the five minute mark. After this one, actually, I'll show you the weather outside and why we are doing it like this. It might seem a little bit cumbersome, which it can be, but this is still pretty helpful to be able to know. 
in case you ever run into something like this, where we can't even see the horizon right now. There's rain, fog, cloudy sky, it's just pretty much the worst conditions you could have for that. We'll open that again. I love that. 